The first storm of the fall season brings wild weather across San Diego County. Good evening, I'm Susan Lennon in for Kathleen tonight. From thunderstorms to lightning to rain and hail, we saw it all today. This is new video tonight from a viewer in Encanto. We've got a lot of great pictures that came in today. The rain really came down there. And take a look at this from Scripps Ranch. Fox 5's Raul Martinez captured hail coming down. Thank you, Raul. The rain from the storm also caused flooding in familiar areas of the county and led to some rescues in the typical places. And in East County, a 60-foot tree came crashing down on a La Mesa home, landing on the roof. We have team coverage tonight on the storm and the impact it had across San Diego tonight. Our Megan Healy is tracking the storm and our Phil Blower has details on flooding problems. But Fox 5's Jamie Chambers starts us off live in La Mesa with a look at the damage there. Jamie. Good evening, Susan. Yeah, it was a pretty extraordinary sight. Take a look behind us. You can see just that twisted lumber behind us. And what's most fascinating is that the earth was not disturbed. So this tree, it snapped right at its trunk's base. The winds, lightning and rain blew through the hills of La Mesa, but it's still unclear what sent this 60 foot tree toppling over Panorama Road. Power lines caught some of the weight as the monkey puzzle pine crashed down onto the home across the street. The roof of the garage was damaged and fire crews were quickly on scene. San Diego Gas and Electric secure the power and then we're gonna have La Mesa Public Works remove the tree out of the roadway. It was a delicate removal process as a backhoe and maintenance crews carefully removed sections of the tree while attempting to keep the power lines from being damaged further. Cutting the last section of the logs was precarious for crews as they cleared away the heavy trunk from the front yard entangled with city power lines. Now, with the power out for many of the local residents, a sigh of relief is being felt for neighbors living high above the city. It's crazy because we have the same type of tree in our yard and I don't know, we just came to see because the street cleared and hoping everyone's okay. And there still are at least five houses without power here on Panorama Drive. But in the end, no one was injured by this massive tree collapse. That's the very latest from La Mesa. Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News. Our Jamie Chambers, thank you so much. Live in La Mesa for us tonight. Thank you.